hello hello how are you guys doing today hello my kings and queens and my loves welcome back to my channel if you're a member if you're new thanks for coming by don't forget to subscribe and uh, click the bell so that way you could get notified each and every time i upload a video so today um there is a tag going on with some of my girlies and the topic is 10 questions tagged so i am here to answer them it's a group of the you know of our ladies just basically answering 15 questions so as always i have them written down here so i will be reading off my notebook because my other phone lady j is playing with it <laughs> so let's get right to it guys the first question, I need my reading glasses. The first question is, what month were you born? And I was born in October. I'm an October baby. Um, October 11, guys. So it's a perfect month to be born because it's not too cold and it's not too hot. So I actually love my birthday month. Um, the second question is, what is my zodiac sign and i am a libra guys october 11 is a libra the third question is what is my sub my subject my worst subject um and my word i have actually more than one so my worst subject is history i don't i don't like history whatsoever i can't remember anything um and the second one is science so those are the two subjects that i don't like at all science and history fourth question guys is what is your favorite cereal yummy who doesn't love cereal everybody loves cereal guys so i actually do have my favorite cereals and those are two i have two favorite cereals number one that tops it off is captain crunch oh my god i love that cereal so much but the one with the berries um that's the one that i like the best i remember growing up i used to have the captain crunch with the berries and i used to eat the rest of the cereal and keep leaving to the side um the the berry balls to the side to the side to the side and then with the at the end with the little bit of milk that i had left i would mash it down the <laughs> with the milk mash real mashed all of them and then eat the berries last i used to love doing that and to this day i still do that my second favorite cereal guys is fruity pebbles oh my god i love that cereal it's so sweet oh my goodness i just love that cereal now the fifth question is what is my favorite color so what i have on i know i have a sweater because i'm looking out the window as you can see i'm looking outside my window i have a sweater so one of my favorite colors is black black looks good with anything that you have on a dress a shirt a sweatshirt doesn't matter what you have it matches with anything that you wear and so um you know the dresses they look so chic and sleek and so elegant and so nice so i love black and my second favorite is like a combination i like burgundy slash uh wine slash purple because um it's just so chic you know and um it also represents something to me um i have lupus so the color for lupus is um purple so somewhere along the line with wine and burgundy and purple i wear a lot and it's for awareness basically um so i either wear black or i wear burgundy purplish kind of colors those are the colors that i prefer and that are my favorite Question number six is, what is my favorite kind of car? Um, 
my favorite kind of car are the Lexus has to be the top one I love the Lexus as in the truck and my second favorite is um, the infinity and they both have to be black because <laughs> of course I love black that which reminds me we're going into the next question which is number seven what is your favorite kind of car so I do own a Toyota RAV4 and it's black it's an SUV and um, that's my third RAV4 um, I went through the first one and it was black and it was also RAV4 um, the second one was a RAV4 as well and it was black as well and now I have my third RAV4 and it's also black so now I'm going I'm going to be checking into my fourth SUV which is going to be a Toyota RAV4 and is also going to be black and the eighth question is uh, my favorite board game I remember when I was growing up I used to love that game called Parcheesi I don't know if you guys um, know that game but Parcheesi was my favorite go-to game and the other one was Sorry I like that game, sorry. I was never into um, games or game consoles or anything of that nature. But, you know, once in a blue moon, if I did decide to pick up a game, it would have been those two games. Um, number nine, where did you grow up? So guys, um, I was born and I was raised in Hoboken, New Jersey. That's right, it's just minutes away from New York City, um, the city that never sleeps. So um, it was always a, a party town. Everywhere you looked, everywhere you walked, every nook and cranny, there was always a place, and there is always a place for you to go to. Um, nobody that lives in Hoboken could say that they're bored. There is always a fun place to go in Hoboken, New Jersey. If not, you know what? Just hop in the train, five minutes, and you're in New York. So that's the, the great part about that. Um, the ninth question is, um, where did you grow up? So once again, I said that already. Number 10, who's your favorite Disney cartoon? That's a tough one. That really is a tough one because I like all kinds of cartoons. I used to collect every single cartoon that came out. It didn't matter if it was Disney, it didn't matter if it was Nickelodeon, it did not matter. If it came out on a DVD or on TV, I will make it a note to always purchase them. So to answer that question is very hard because I have a lot, a lot, a lot of favorites. I'm a very big cartoon fanatic. I like to watch cartoons with uh, Lady J or even by myself, so I wouldn't be able to answer that. But just so you know, I love my Disney cartoons, yes. Question number 11, who is your hero? My hero, because I have been in so many, so many um, occasions as far as car accidents, um, as far as calling now, I want to go to the emergency room um, regarding my um, my heart conditions and my lupus, and uh, I have four hip replacements. So my hero uh, throughout all this is that the EMS is my hero, my doctors are my heroes, the nurses are my heroes, the fire department are my heroes. Um, the um, uh, police officers are my heroes and not to mention um, the scientists that come up with medications to make you better you know um, if it wasn't because of the scientists that created the medications for my heart condition I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the scientists that created the medications for lupus I would not be sitting here. If it wasn't for the scientists that created the medication for fibromyalgia, I would not be here. So you know what? Those are my heroes. Um, 
and so the EMTs, the fire department, the police officers, the doctors, the nurses, the scientists, anything along that line to save us and are on the front line for us, the Army, the Navy, the National Guards, the Marines, you name it, all of them are my, na are my superheroes and I gave you the thumbs up and kudos to you and I salute each and every one of you. Um, and um, the 12th question is, what is your favorite store? Well, obviously, I have more than one. You guys know that. I mean, I know you two have more than one store, but my ultimate first, first, first store is Dollar Tree. You guys got it right. You guys got it right. My, my first choice is Dollar Tree. Now, my second choice is a store called Dollar Zone that I always mention in a few of my previous videos. Go back and check them out. It's a store called Dollar Zone, which everything is a dollar in the store. Something similar to Dollar Tree, um, but they have a lot of also name brand things, a lot of electronic name brand things. And so that's my second one. And my third store will be Walmart. Of course, because Walmart has a little bit of everything in the store. You could go grocery shopping, you could go clothes shopping, you could go jewelry shopping, you could go electronic shopping, shoe shopping, um, you name it, is there. So that, those are my three top stores. Um, question number 13 is, have you ever performed on stage? Sorry about that, guys. Have you ever performed on stage? Guys, yes, I have. Very, very, very long time ago, probably about two decades ago, um, I went to a concert and it was a freestyle concert. And uh, these two um, artists had came up to me asking me if I wanted to be a background dancer. And of course I said yes, because I was healthy. I knew how to dance. I didn't have my broken hip. I didn't have a heart condition and all of the above. So I said, why not? So I took on the challenge and yes, I did perform on stage with thousands and thousands of people watching. Obviously I can't do that now, but I have those great, great memories of me going up there and seeing everybody looking at me, looking down, looking at all the lights, cheering, cheering me on. Some of them I knew um, from the audience and um, I mean I can't tell you the great experience that that was and if I could do it all over again I would do it in a heartbeat in a heartbeat guys um, the next question is did you go to private school no I did not I went to a public school um, and that's the end of that and the last question is who was your celebrity crush when you were growing up? So guys, I have two. And what I'm about to tell you is probably going to shock you. I know, I know, I know. You don't have to tell me. It's going to shock you guys. But it's my crush. It's what I have here. And it's what I see with my eyes. And it's what I feel in my heart. The very first one is Patrick Swayze. He was my favorite, my favorite, favorite, favorite. I can't tell you how many times I watched his movies over and over and over, especially in Dirty Dancing. Oh my God, I love him so much. And when I tell you the devastating news that he had pancreatic cancer, it was unconsolable. I was literally crying. My tears were really, really crying. Like that hurt me for so long. And to this day, to this day, I still can't believe that he's gone. I don't even want to think about it, but may God rest his soul in peace up above. He became one of our angels. And then the second one, guys, is Richard Gere. Oh my God, I love him so much. He's such a, a good actor. I love him in um, Pretty Woman. And I loved, 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 loved him in Shall We Dance. Oh my God, I love that man. Um, even now, I just love him. You know, he, he's so handsome to me. So, um, 
I mean, it's 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 water like, right? Um, so guys, thanks again for joining me. Thanks for doing the tag challenge, and I hope that you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up. Please share and feel free to tag yourself, guys. I love each and every one of you. Um, bless all of you and your family, and I will be praying for each and every one of you. I appreciate all of your support, and guys. Mm. Until next time, bye.